Hello class, this is Mamse, signing on. This video lecture will talk about how to create an outlet in NetBeans. Let's begin! So how to create your Hello World outlet? There are actually so many ways how to do it, but we'll try the simplest one. So, of course, first you need to open your NetBeans, and then you click File, New Project, and then you click, make sure that in the categories you choose Java, and then click Java Application, and then click Next. And do not forget our syntax for the file name, your last name, do not forget to type your last name, and then let's name it hello, your last name, and then hello. Make sure that the create main class is checked, then click the finish button. And then wait for a while, wait for the NetBeans to create the project, now that the project is created, so click on the project node, right click that, click new, and then choose applet. If applet is not in the options, you can go to the other and then look for Java in the categories again, click Java and then choose applet. Okay, but if it is in the option, simply cancel this one. Again, you have to right click the Java node or the package node, click new and then choose applet. On the package field, choose the package last name hello. And then for our class name, let's name it hello. And then click the finish button. Here's now the template for our Hello Outlet. Now for the first class that has been created, we could just simply close this. And then we can proceed with our Hello Applet. We won't be needing a lot of comments, just simply single line comment to insert your signature. Again, you have to place your full name here as part of your signature. Just like what we are always doing with all our source code. can now erase other comments. We won't be needing all this stuff. So just simply remove this to clear our screen. Once this screen is clear, you can now type the source code for our Hello World. Notice that we import the package applet so that we could use the class applet we could extend the class applet to make this whole program a small application or the so-called applet we also import the awt package or abstract window toolkit package so that we could call the class graphics 
the class graphics is responsible for displaying a dialog box in our output. So we named our constructor G. And then we call the method here draw string so that we could display the text. Hello last name. And for the 80 and 100, this is the for the position of our text in our source code, rather in our dialog box, once we run the program. Let's run our program by simply right-clicking on the source code, and then you choose Run File, and then you wait. So here's now the output of our program. Hello, last name. Do not forget the word last name here be replaced with your own last name. And this is our simple sample applet hello. And this is how to cre create a simple program with an applet. So this is the steps that you're going to follow when you create an applet program all throughout our lessons about applet. Try to troubleshoot your source code. Try to make trial and error by replacing the value here and observe what happened. So that's it. Good luck and enjoy working with Applet program. And that ends our discussion. Hope this quotes inspires you as you develop your programming skills in Applet. And so that's it. Watch out for more video lectures. Stay safe and God bless everyone. Thank you for watching. This is Mom Says, signing off.